Hello everybody, PJ here for Intense Computing and today we will be talking about uh, how to change your IP address on a Linksys router by changing your MAC address. Now the first step to uh, changing your IP address is to know how you get your IP address. So we're going to go ahead over to ipchicken.com link will be in the description and you'll see your IP address. Now mine is start out, however um, when you see it, you will notice uh, that this IP address you might not be familiar with. Now, how you get this IP address is by your MAC address. If you don't know your MAC address, you can go into your uh, network settings on your computer. Now, I'm running a MAC, but the same rule applies for Windows. Um, so, once you uh, figure out kind of how um, IP addresses work with that simple explanation, um, you can change your IP address right here by changing that MAC address. Now, if you're running a router, that's how I'm going to be showing you today. But if not, um, I don't believe there is a way to change your IP address or to change your MAC address right from your computer. So let's go ahead over uh, into your uh, settings on your router or your configuration. So that's on a Linksys router, 192.168.1.1. I'm sorry, I put in commas.1.1. .1. And we're going to go over to the MAC address and cloning bar. Let's click on that. And now you're going to see this little combination of letters and numbers here. Now, I'm not going to change mine. However, what you want to do is change the last digits or last um, character in the last box here. Uh, and you're going to... Um, or in the last set of numbers at least. And so I would do 8. Now I'm going to put it back to 7, um, but whatever yours is, just change it one number up from the current number or letter, um, and that should change your IP address. However, first you need to reset your modem and router, so unplug them after you click clone your PC's Mac. So uh, click clone your PC's Mac and wait for it to save the settings. It might take a minute and then um, you'll notice that you probably will drop internet connection and reset your uh, network, your um, router and modem. And then there you go, your, IP ad your entire IP address is changed on your whole network. So if you get banned from uh, any websites, you'll be able to easily access them again. So again, this has been uh, PJ, and um, we will be having a part two of this video for Netgear um, uh, routers in coming up actually. So, uh, until next time, best tech, best talk.